Uh, where to start with Rash? Rash is a lot more layered than Sharp. Sharp was more inclusive in the way that a it was apolitical. So Sharp had members that were, you could be right wing, left wing, no wing. Um, they stayed out of politics. They did not do like, um, you know, political marches or anything like that um, back in the day. I mean, I know, I know in like later days they got involved with some of that stuff, but they weren't really heavy on it. Sharp pretty much stuck to just fighting boneheads at shows. They weren't really even big on, on um, street violence. They were mostly just big on fighting boneheads at punk shows. Now, Redskins also fought boneheads at punk shows, um, but they were more into sort of like deterring them like when boneheads would show up passing out racist literature the redskins would confiscate it throw it out and throw them out um whereas sharp would get into like arguing with them about about using the skinhead name at all and like or wearing their clothes and they would get into fights and like you know steal their boots steal their braces steal their laces saying that you can't wear our shit because you know, uh, because skinhead is a multicultural subculture, and so if you're racist, that doesn't fit. You're not a real skinhead, so we're going to take your shit. Um, Rash didn't care about clothes. <laughs> you know, Rash really did not. You know, Rash actually cared about politics and ideologies. They didn't really care what someone was wearing. They cared what someone was doing. And Rash was not as heavily present at... Um, at shows as they were on the street. Rash was like community, uh, community cops, kind of. They were like community defense on the, on the street. They were very, very ha heavy, heavy action on the street, as in protecting people from hate crimes. And when I say protecting people from hate crimes, I do not mean, um, you know, showing up at like a right wing rally and throwing Molotov cocktails at them because honestly, that makes you just as fascist as they are. When I say protecting people from hate crimes, I mean if they saw somebody beating up an immigrant, raping a woman, um, hassling a minority, any of that shit, they would step step in and they would kick that person's ass or, you know, sometimes they were <laughs> depending on how bad the situation was. But yeah, that stuff happened. Like, it happened. Now, because Rash formed in 1993, you had to be either left-wing or apolitical. So you could be an anarchist. You could be someone who was just against all governments. That was fine. You could be libertarian. You could be anything on the left. You could be communist, socialist, anything, but you could not be right-wing at all.